This is the Weber Spirit Barbecue Propane Gas Grill. I've owned it for two years, and here's my likes and dislikes. The first thing I noticed right off the bat is the ignition system. Just a click of a button, and the first burner lights up every time. Then the next two burners light up just as easy. It's got this crossover ignition system, so it works perfectly every time. I've never had a problem starting the barbecue. I love it. A lot of barbecues in the past I've had, I've always given me problems with that, but this one works beautifully. These are flavorizer grill bars. They give a nice impression to the meat or to the burgers or steak or whatever you're cooking. Now, one of the things I really noticed about this is it heats up super fast. Within a few minutes, it'll crank up to 600 degrees. There isn't really any cold spots on the grill. Uh, there isn't really any hot spots on the grill. It's, it cooks evenly because of the type of porcelain enameled cooking grill. Uh, it gives a nice even heat across the entire grill, which I really enjoyed. It's not perfect, but there's, it's definitely better than a lot of other barbecues I've used in the past. It has these nice two side tables, which are really handy. I use them all the time to put um, all the finished cooks. And it takes no time to cook. Like this is a hot, this is a hot machine. I can't believe how fast it cooks. Within minutes, everything's ready. Depending on how big your family is, you'll definitely be uh, not waiting long. Okay, let's talk about dislikes. There's a few little things. One of the things is how the propane tank fits into the barbecue. It's a little awkward. It's not a huge deal, but you do have to squat down and kind of really have a lot of good flexibility and strength to get it on the actual lever. Uh, it can be a touch awkward, but I can get the regulator on no problem. Everything fits nicely that way. There's a drip pan underneath that catches all the grease. It's not super big. So you just have to keep an eye on it, um, make sure it doesn't overflow. It takes a long time for it to, to fill up, but it is something to keep an eye on. Okay. And the other thing is it tends to get hot really fast in areas that you may not want it to get hot like the side tables tend to get really warm you don't get they don't, they don't get to the point where you can get burned or anything but they do get really warm and um, i guess it, in a way it could be a positive because it keeps your food warm as well overall i'm really glad we got this barbecue i use it every day and uh it's been a great addition to the family pros definitely outweigh the con and hopefully this helps you in your next purchase talk to you later